Dear Adam, I am a member of the booby train list. That's how I got your name. I'm almost through your book and it has certainly given me some new ideas. Gypsy is a one and a half year old booby, eh? She is very high strung but we're working on it. You're absolutely right that it does no good to send your dog away to school. For $900 bucks she now does just what the dog trainer tells her to do. I'm getting a lot better, though. Here's my question. I exercise her in the morning. We play ball for 30 minutes and then we walk a mile practicing sits, downs and stays. At night we play ball for about 15 minutes. I work from 10 a.m. to about 7 p.m. She stays in the kitchen with a dog door leading to a large 6 feet fenced backyard. She sleeps almost all day and she doesn't sleep at night. She paces and barks. I make her stay in the kitchen so I can get some sleep. I don't know any other Bouvier so I don't know if this is normal or not. She has hip dysplasia and has had hip surgery. I thought it might be pain so tried giving her an aspirin at night. Didn't help. I tried getting up to correct her but she hears me and gets in bed before I get there. The kitchen has a large bay window to the front of the house but there are curtains. She's been doing this for months and I haven't had a full night's sleep in months, either. Would crating her help? Any ideas would be appreciated. Robbie and Gypsy. Dear Robbie. Thanks for sending me this email. It's a perfect example as to why simply ignoring bad behavior will never work on dogs that care more about pleasing themselves than anything else. When she starts to bark, you'll need to yell, no, from your bedroom, and then continue saying, no, 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 as you run to her and administer a correction. It doesn't matter if she climbs back in her bed at this point, as you've already used the word, no, as an event marker. So she'll know what she's being corrected for. As long as you continue saying, no, you have an additional 7 to 14 seconds in which the dog will still associate your correction with the behavior. Put a crate in your bedroom and let her sleep in it. Even though it doesn't seem like much to us humans, dogs think that sleeping together is quality time when they're not alone. You may also try just putting her on a leash and attaching the leash to the foot of your bed. If she knows a down stay, you can simply correct her if she gets up. After a couple of evenings, she'll learn that when you bring her into the bedroom and make her lay down, it's time to stay put. If you don't feel that her hip is bothering her, I would recommend increasing the amount of exercise time. Feed her as soon as you get home from work and then take her out and play ball for at least 30 minutes. If you can't play ball with her for a whole hour, then work her through a very intense obedience routine, heel, sit, heel, down, come, heel, etc., for about 15 minutes and then play ball with her for another 10 minutes. When I lived in Berkeley, California I had an American Pit Bull Terrier that was a very high-energy bitch. If I took her to the park on a Monday afternoon and played fetch for a whole hour, we'd later return to my apartment and within 20 minutes she'd be bouncing off the walls again. However, if I took her out on a Wednesday and we simply did an intense obedience routine for 20 minutes, we'd return to the apartment and she would collapse under my coffee table and not move for the next two hours. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button and feel free to subscribe for more videos.